What is up guys, Ninja Miner here, and today we will be looking at how to install mods on Minecraft Pocket Edition and how to install texture packs using just a few simple apps. Alright, let's get to it. So, um, hold on, why did everything freeze? Don't freeze, don't freeze. Okay, there we go. So today we will be... Uh, looking at this, you'll you'll just need two apps. Of course, you'll need Minecraft and you'll need Block Launcher. Now, choose any apps that you. Well, hold on, hold on. First of all, you'll need to go to your settings, and you'll need to enable um, allow installation of apps from sources other than Play Store. This is found in lock screen and security. If you have like the latest update for Androids. And yeah, so right here you just need to put that, leave that on, press OK, and OK, you're set. So um, now you're going to go to Chrome or w whatever browser you want. Uh, go to go to whatever mod you want. Like for for this example, I'm using the Minimap mod, the Smooth Minimap mod by MX Galdo. Oh, wait, never mind. It says coal, mod, coal miner here. Whatever. So, um, you're going to go down here where it says download, and you're going to click either Dropbox or Mediafire. I prefer Mediafire. So, wait until, oh crap, it, ah. So, Mediafire, here you go. Okay, um, skip ad. And you're just going to have to wait until it loads. Now, this may not work on some, um, uh, wait, yeah, this not, may not work on some devices because I'll, I'll show you in a bit. So, download what you want. Oh, man, this wasn't, uh, I don't think this was for Minecraft Pocket Edition. I think it was for the actual Minecraft. Hold on, I'm just going to go download the real one really quick. Choose whatever mod you want and press download and it'll work. Unlike what I did. Okay, this time I went back and chose Dropbox just to see if it was better. And there's a little download sign right here. I may have not seen it before. Maybe it was there for the other one, but still. Alright, so direct download. You can see it popping up in a second now. And minimap mod complete. So now you're just gonna um, go to your files. You also need a file app. I forgot about that. Download history. Then press import. You just have to tap on it and press import. All right. And then you go to block launcher. Wait for it to load. And press this little button on top that looks like a wrench press launcher options then go right here and enable mod p script support come here I've already done this um, hold on I don't want mutant creatures right now um, so I've already done this and all you need to do is press back one more time and it will work it just needs to load a bit. And here we go. So, I'll go to my main thing. And now, wait for it to load. It's a bit glitchy right now. And now, if you see, there's a little thing right here. That's the mod. You see where the little dot is? Hold on, let me put it on first person really quick. So now, as you can see right here, there's something, and if you tap it, that's the, yeah, that's the, this is the mod. It would work probably for any mod that you have, which is good. So, yeah. Now we're going to go on to texture packs. Oh, yeah, one more thing. The Remember when I said before that it might not work for some people? It was because, um, like... 
when you go in a launcher options, look, I'll show you. Oh yeah, look, the mods are working already, right here. It's pretty cool. Alright, so press the wrench. It might not be working either because you have too many scripts working at once, too many mods, or because you simply forgot to turn this on. That might be the thing also. Alright, let's move on to texture packs now. Alright, you're just gonna wanna find whatever texture pack you want. I'll leave the links in this for this in the description if you want to download the exact ones that I'm downloading. But yeah, so I'll download this texture pack now and I'll show you what to do next. Alright, I have downloaded the texture pack that I wanted. And let's click this little button up here again. Uh, the little the little wrench on top. Launcher options again, and then you're want to you're gonna want to hit on for texture pack way on the top, and go select, and then wherever you downloaded that texture pack that would work. Um, if mine just happens to be on downloads, so yeah. So now that it's enabled, you press back, back again. And it should work. I'm sorry, guys, that um, it's a bit slow today, my tablet. So, yeah, this is the texture pack that I chose, and it is pretty cool. I'm just going to give a review really quick for this texture pack. Um, so, whoa, it looks a lot different. And hold on, let me do something real quick. I'm sorry, guys, for not... Um, posting in a long time I just haven't had that much time right now because of school and stuff like that so yeah I'll go give the thing now oh, where'd it go where did you go put control to the left I'm not a lefty let's put controls on okay so it looks pretty cool, and whoa, everything looks so weird. All right, let me go outside. Even look at the iron doors. This is right here is clay. Let me see how the villagers look. Cause that look, I think that would be really cool. Oh man, this is why I don't like buttons. I might change that. All right, whoa. Oh, the water is the same. I really like how they made the trees. That looks really cool. And the grass. Oh, the, the grass is short and stubby. Pretty cool. Whoa. Alright. Oh, look. Flint and steel is now a little matchstick thing. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Anvils. I'll just let you guys look at this real quick. If you want, you can pause it to where you want to see everything, but I'm just going down pretty slowly, so, yeah. They haven't changed too much of, like, basic material. Oh, cool, look at diamond. Alright. Again, this should work with any texture pack that you download, if it's, like, not a virus or anything that you're downloading. If it's the right one. Um, what are these scissors? Shears. Oh, these are pretty cool. Lava bucket, water bucket, milk bucket, and regular bucket. Um, Alright, that'll be it for today, guys. If I'm actually going to do a quick a review of how many of the things right now, of the spawn. So, you can go now. But if you want to stay and watch me look at all these, it's also fine. Alright, let's start with... Oh, it looks so cool. Oh, these are awesome. Okay, I just took the first few. So, villagers, you already saw how they look like. Whoa, they look weird now. So weird. Alright, sheep. Look at me in the face. Look, look, I want to see your face. Oh! What the heck? Their face is the same as their wool. Oh, never mind. Oh, it is. Oh, well. I 
guess it's just a little bug that they have. Wolf, ocelot, of course it runs away. Mushroom, bat, rabbit, if you have the new update. So that was rabbit. So creeper, enderman, silverfish, skeleton, slime, spider, and zombie now. So there's this creep. Whoa. Enderman. Oh man. Whoa, their eyes are blue now. Silverfish. Skeleton. Duh, I can't see it. Alright, look at me, skeleton. Look at me, skeleton. Whoa. Oh, they look cool now. Um, spiders look pretty much the same. Zombies look. I don't know how they look. Let me spawn them in the shadow. Look at me, zombie. Look at me, zombie. Why aren't you burning? Okay. Next, we got zombie pigmen, squid, cave spider, magma cube, ghast, blaze. Zombie pigmen. Squid. Oh, they're so tiny now. Oh, never mind. That was a baby, baby squid. Cave spider, magma cube, looks the same. Guest. Look at me, guest. Oh. Blaze. I really didn't want to spawn that. And z wait, I did dummy. Let's spawn some of the made items. I really like how they did the stuff here. Okay, so it is where are the where's the stuff? Oh, right here. Iron block and I'm just gonna have to guess what all the stuff is. Cause this is pretty confusing by how it looks. Oh that's snow. Okay. So let's spawn an iron golem really quick. Jump, jump, okay. And pumpkin. They look pretty much the same except for the snow. But, yeah. I'll leave these guys to take care of all the bad things that I just spawned. And I'll just spawn an iron golem too. Let's see. Don't kill the wolf. Wolf is my friend. Oops. These guys look pretty cool, too. Alright, thank you guys. That is it for this video slash uh, texture pack review, I guess. Alright, guys, be sure to leave a like. And, yeah, please subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more of these videos, it won't be exactly the same again. But comment in the, in the comment below what you want me to put from now on. And, yeah. Now, if you guys um, want me to do more like texture pack reviews or how to download things, it's also good. Yeah, so just leave it in the, in the comments. And one more thing, guys. Um, man, I just lost my train of thought and I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah. Alright. Thank you for watching this video on how to install texture packs and mods in Minecraft Pocket Edition. Goodbye.